Good morning, all. CamelbackTrading.org coming to you this Wednesday morning, September 11th. We're looking at Window Trader's market profile of the ESNNQ. I'm going to talk about the market quickly, and then I want to talk about uh, today's date, if you indulge me uh, with me. Look, first of all, here's the market, okay? 8.30 is CPI, another 10, 10 minutes or so away. This is all noise Monday and Tuesday. Okay, the real move, if it comes today, will be above Friday's high or below Friday's low. That's right. Plain and simple. The weekly, for now, are in balance. The monthly are in balance. The dailies are in balance. So until you can't turn the weekly or monthlies around until the daily comes out of balance one way or the other. Right? And then they follow along. So at 8.30, you're going to get probably some really stupid gyrations all over the place. No real advantage to trade it. So at 9.30, after everything is digested, then when market-generated information starts forming, hopefully we'll get a better idea if we're coming out of this balance. There's no guarantee of it. You might get a rip up above Friday's high or a rip down below Friday's low at 8.30, but at 9.30, we might be trading right back in here. So please keep that all in mind, Okay. Um, those, those are your lines in the sand. Friday's high, Friday's low for ES and Q. Now, righty's a little different because righty's down on the daily. So yesterday's high is very important for them to come back into balance. Okay? And then they'll start forming their balance. So just keep that in mind. As far as today goes, uh, it's amazing that it's 23 years ago uh, that our world changed. Um, I read an article yesterday that more firemen now have died from 9-11 il illnesses than died that day. It's like 1,100 people that were never identified. There's countless thousands who keep suffering sicknesses and death from different types of cancers. Um, a lot of friends of mine, myself included, have issues uh, I just want people, you know, we always say never forget, but as time goes by with, you see, D-Day, Pearl Harbor, um, even the Holocaust, unfortunately, it starts waning from people's memories, and it's especially as years go by, um, and, and younger people don't even know what happened with some of these things. Um, uh, never forget the day, uh, when we returned from work on that Monday, September 17th, walked up Wall Street, because I had to take the ferry now. There was no more path train, obviously. And on the corner of Wall and Broad was a tank, a regular-sized regular, regular -sized army tank with Wall Street streaming with soldiers with automatic weapons. And just said, our world has changed dramatically. Um... The, st the smell down there for months and months on end was just terrific and uh, just something to keep in mind. And the main reason I'm also saying this is you, you look how, uh, I, you know, I, I hate, I'm not political, I don't want to be political, but you look at how divided our country is and you watch that debate last night and say this is the best that we have to offer and the hate, the hate that just comes out on every side the lying, the BS, and they just use the average person, you and I, as pawns in their game. So at some point, I hope people realize that we are just a pawn in their game, and government as a whole sucks. So I want to wish you all good luck today. Uh, this is the last time you'll ever hear on this. I'll recap today's action at four o'clock. And again, I'd love for you to come check us out at camelbacktrading.org. There's many different price points. And I also, I offer a discount for anybody who served in the military or is in the military. So come check us out. And thank you so much for liking and subscribing to this channel.